when Niall uh, eventually came around, um, there was nothing. There was absolutely nothing. There was no speech. There was no movement. There was no. He was actually just a shadow of himself. There was, you know, there was no engaging. He was vague. It was. Um, I say it was affected. Uh, speech, left hand side. It was completely gone uh, at that stage. He was tracked and pegged. <clears throat> he totally dependent on, on everyone to do everything for him. It's changed my life in every way. It's probably more challenging, but I, I'll do it anyway because. I think I have to, have to. Without us knowing, friends, family put the most magnificent extension onto our home for Niall, um, as we call it Niall's pad, for his rehabilitation, for his own space, for his privacy. And the priceless, you didn't really appreciate at the time. What was going on? What was going on? But in the background, uh, they, they, were, they, were, they, were, they were doing a lot of things. Niall is incredible. He is probably one of the most determined people I've ever met. His whole thinking and uh, language is used up with words like, I will. I will survive, I will walk, I will talk, I will swim. And each time he does exactly what he says he's going to do, in fact, he walked um, a leg of the marathon for the Stroke Association two years ago. I thought I knew my son, but I didn't. I just didn't. The, the resolve and the dedication and the hard work and the sheer commitment to what he has done with our help, but it's all now. He's done it all. And he's humbling. Yeah. He is the most humbling person to be around. And I'm so, so proud of him. We are. We're very, very, very proud of him. Niall will never give up. He has still so many goals and targets and he keeps on pushing himself. And he has so many ambitious plans. And there's some speculation that he might be for Rio 2016 for the Paralympics. And I wouldn't be one bit surprised. Just watch this space. I hope to achieve, achieve everything I wanted to achieve before this and if anything I want to achieve more and I'd like to send a message to people who might go through this situation and give them hope and say Take your time and walk out and you'll be fine. And um yeah.